So a couple months ago I took a GoPro camera and I attached it to a spinning ceiling fan to sort of create a ghetto bullet time matrix effect. The problem with that is that the GoPro only shoots at 240 frames per second. So to fix that, my buddies at Aim Research let me borrow their phantom high speed camera which shoots at up to 20,000 frames per second. The problem with that is that the camera is just too heavy and expensive to spin it around like we did with the GoPro. So I got with my NASA engineer buddy Ken here and we built a crazy rig. And by we I mean mostly him. So we put the camera in a protective enclosure below a spinning armature that has two mirrors on it. So the light from the object that we're interested in filming bounces off both mirrors and down into the camera lens. So it's basically like the camera is spinning around really fast at 200 RPMs even though it's perfectly safe below. And that's how you get really awesome footage like this. And we've actually been shooting slingshots at these things all day long and it wasn't toward near the end of the day that we realized there's a massive propane tank right behind uh, yeah, basically where we're shooting. But nobody died, so... So my buddy Destin from Smarter Every Day actually helped out with the rig and he made a video about the importance of all the failures we encountered with trying to build it. Because there were a lot. Alright, 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 stop, 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 stop. Oh. So you should go check it out. You can also check out some of my other videos like how to make a delicious smoothie with a drill and a coat hanger. Or how to totally dominate your ugly Christmas sweater party without even trying that hard. And finally, if you need to rent a high speed camera, Nathan at AIM Research will take care of you including sending an operator with the camera if needs be. They are awesome to work with and best of all, they are way way more affordable than anything else I could find out there. So they've got a YouTube channel here or you can check out their info for rentals in the description.